Hi mga kaposh, this is Josh once again and welcome back to my channel. Today's video, birthday ng ate. Um, papunta na naman ako ulit ng kabuling area. And since meron siyang maliit na celebration, bumili ng cake. At ngayon, pupunta tayo sa Estrels. I'm sure alam nyo yung kung saan yung Estrels or alam nyo yung Estrels. Um, it's a big shop or cake shop where ang Chelsea nila is caramel cake. Um, ang gusto ko kasi sa Estrels is siya yung tipo ng cake na in between matamis at hindi matamis. Because as you know, karamihan sa mga cake ngayon, halos lahat nagtatamisan. So, since katatapos lang ng holiday at sobrang ang healthy na mga tinira namin pagkain, gusto naman namin na maging mag-feeling-feeling healthy ngayon. So, kapunta na ako ngayon doon sa Estrels at pagdating ko doon, i-update ko kayo kung may nagbago sa mga prices nila. And at the same time, kung sa mga hindi nakakaalam, and I'm sure na gusto nyo matikman yung Estrels cake na yan, um, sasabihin ko sa inyo kung paano makapunta doon. And ano yung mga dapat nyo i-expect or ano yung dapat nyo gawin upon putting an order. Although they have a website and they have a Facebook account, that's something that you can check also. So, update ko kayo later mamaya. Bye! Actually, meron na silang parking ngayon. Hindi kagaya dati, magpa-park ka lang along the main road or sa Scout of Gas. Pero nga, meron na silang dedicated parking. Okay siya. Actually, tumawag na sila sa akin kanina, mga 5 minutes ago. Kasi kailangan mo yata ang pick-upin. Kung 5 o'clock mo siya ni-schedule, 2 hours ahead, kailangan pick-upin mo na. So, nagpa-follow up talaga. Tara. manage nila yung influx ng tao. Tapos, kailangan mas ang ganda mo. Thank you so much. God, ang kinis mo. Iba talaga mag-alaga si Sinagawa. <laughs> Sinagawa ka ba? In fairness, Tara. So, yun na nga. Meron na kaming number, number 17. Pero wala naman masyadong maraming tao. Tingnan mo. kami, walang masyadong maraming tao. So, kukunin na lang namin, pipick up namin. Number 17 kami, pero number 16 na yung inabutan namin. So, let's go. Kasi may pupuntahan pa kami after this. Okay. So, 
bibigyan ka lang kayo ng konting idea about that. Uh, ako, it's my personal choice is mas gusto ko talaga yung lasa ng um, Estrell's Caramel Cake. Um, actually, isang, once ko lang siya natikman, but hindi talaga yung caramel cake yung una ko natikman, but yung kanilang leche flan. Yung kanilang leche flan back then was just at 185 pesos, pero when I went there last time, nasa 200 pesos na. And uh, nagustuhan ko yung leche flan nila kasi hindi siya sobrang matamis, pero alam mo yung sobrang thick nung kanyang um, uh, leche flan at yun talaga yung hinarag ko sa leche flan. Hindi masyadong matamis, um, hindi masyadong lasang-lasang asukal at the same time, siksik yun naman siya. Ang sarap na cake na natikpan ko na chiffon covered with cal- caramel icing. Uh, kasi kadalasan ng mga cake na matitikman mo it's either sa quantities o doon masarap din naman talaga yung quantities like yung mga ba- mango bravo, mango cheesecake, yung mga black forest ng red ribbon. Pero kasi if you're, if you're getting, you know, nag, medyo nag-age ka na din, you tend to be more conscious of what you eat and try to lessen your sugar. And um, when I tasted it, I find it so good. And every time that we have a celebration, I make it a point that if it's special, I, I buy that. Talaga dinadayo pa siya sa Quezon City. And it was just very near. And I know that place because we I used to reside before sa Kamuning area. Doon talaga ako lumaki sa Kamuning Road. And uh, they're currently located at 54 Scout Tobias, Corner Scout Lambada Street, Barangay Laging Handa. Quezon City. So, kung madadaan kayo sa Timog area, sobrang malapit na lang yun sa Timog. So, pwede niya na lang pagtanungan and uh, I'll post it on the description box yung kanyang actual address. So, kung nakita niyo dun sa video ko kanina, sobrang laki ng pinagbago ng area nila. They have three parking lots already. And most of the time, pag nagpunta kayo doon ng, ng holiday, as in talagang pila yung mga sasakyan doon. But what, what's good thing about their process right now is that you can um, make a phone call so that you can reserve it for their schedule. They're open from Monday to Friday and they're also open from Monday to Saturday and they're open until Sunday as well. So Monday to Friday, they're opening at 8.30 in the morning to 7 p.m. And for Sunday, they're open at 8.30 to 5 p.m. Uh, you can also see that on the website. Now, also, they have uh, specialties. So, aside from having the... Meron silang mga iba't ibang klase ng cakes. So, meron silang round cakes. Meron silang rectangular cakes. Meron silang layer cakes. Meron silang seasonal cake and specialty cake. So, it could cater to any special occasions. Maybe a Christmas, New Year, birthday, anniversary, or anything. Uh... I'm sure that's something that they can help you with pagdating sa design or types ng cake. So, talking about their um, over-the-phone ordering process, you just need to call them and then you just need to tell them the time. Um, and I think they reserve, they, they prefer to reserve the cake within the day. And uh, on some occasions, they are also requiring for an advance payment or a deposit but in my case since i only purchased the round cake around about 700 around about 750 pesos lang yung price hindi naman na ako nila um or hiningaan ng um na half but as far as i know it's something that you can check on the website also pag makikita mo doon na if you say for example you cancel um your order within the day because obviously they would have to prepare it then the uh, deposit is non refundable. So you need to be sure kung ano talaga yung order na gusto mo at anong flavor at make sure na talaga makukuha mo siya that day. Because otherwise, yung deposit mo will be non refundable. And for me, that's also good because that only gives me an assurance na talaga yung cake nila is a big, fresh, and really made. On their website, they also uh, place their um, some tips on how to enjoy your cake. Actually, Yung, na, yung nabili namin cake kanina, nagka-problema kami kasi nilapag ko lang siya dun sa, sa driver seat. At hindi namin na malaya na may layers pala yun. So dahil nakaslant lang siya ng konti, hindi talaga siya yung teretso. Ang nangyari is yung nandun sa top taas niya, ang uh, nagslide. 
So, na-deform ng konti yung cake. So, ganun siya kalambot, if I could say it that way, or ganun siya ka... Um, you need to be very careful. So, sabi dito sa website nila, how best to enjoy extra if it doesn't have any preservatives. They really suggest that you consume the cake when they're living. And frosting are soft and needs to be in cold places all the time. So, yung sinasabi mga kanina yung naging problema kasi sobrang init noon at hindi pa maayos yung pagkakalagay sa kanya. So, nag-slide siya. Parang nag-slide siya na deforming cake. So, you need to make sure parang it's just very common. Like, parang bumili ka lang din ng cake sa DQ or para ka lang ice cream cake ng DQ or para ka lang bumili ng Bango Bravo. Yung mga ganun. At yung, um, siguro matatravel mo lang siya maximum na talaga. One hour to two hours. Para ma-make sure na quality pa rin yung cake at fresh mo pa rin siya matitikman. Sabi dito, kung hindi mo pa isa-serve yung cake, it's better na ilagay mo siya sa air-conditioned room. Kung hindi man, siguro keep it refrigerated. Must not, you must never put it on a warm area kasi nga may tendency, mat, may tendency siyang matunaw at madideform yung itsura ng cake. In case, for example, may matitira kayo, um, it's okay, but make sure you put it on a container, seal it properly, and keep, uh, make sure that it's well refrigerated or, if, or make sure that it's refrigerated so you can consume it. In my case, siguro maximum 9 2 days. After 2 days, hindi na rin siya talaga quality, hindi na rin ganun gaganda yung texture. So, I really suggest, kung ikaw lamang isa or hindi naman kayo ganun karami, piliin na lang yung mga round cakes. Then, ano na day, pare-parehas lang din naman yung lasa niya. So, yun lang guys. Again, just in case, for example, gusto niyo makatikim ng caramel cake. Um, and for me, I find it healthy. It's a healthy caramel cake because hindi nga siya ganun katamis. And at the same time, um, I have never tasted any cakes na ganun yung lasa, no? And uh, if you want to check them out, you can visit them at www.estrels.com And you also have a Facebook account. Just type in their trust, Estrels um, Big Shop. And for sure, lalabas na yun doon. And again, they're currently located in Quezon City 54, Scout Tobias, Corner Scout Lembaga Street, Barangay Laging Handa, Quezon City. So, yun lang guys. Um, I just feel like I want to share that out with you. And just in case you, you um, find this video helpful. And uh, if you have friends also wishes to, you know, get more information about it. You can, you're free and um, I will appreciate it if you like and share the video. And if you're not yet subscribed to my channel, please do so. And also, don't forget to hit the bell button just in case. So at least if I already video, which I would in the future, because I'm trying to revamp my content. Because as you would know, guys, iba iba yung nagiging content ko. This is just mainly based from you know message and PMs that they ask me to do. But in the next few days or in the next few months, um, I'm trying to revamp everything in my vlog to focus on a particular um, uh, niche. And uh, so at least you will be able to know more about it. Click the bell button so you will be notified if just in case I start into or I have a video uh, in this vlog. Alright? So that's just about it guys. Thank you for watching and I'll see you on my next vlog. Bye!